there are some resembles and the comparisons between some big projects, Eiffel Tower, Statue of Unity, and Burj Khalifa. 2 lakhs metric tons cement. So capacity 2,500 roughly cubic meter per hour. So now there are some events. There's a casting of Fox full span box cutter at Chainage. This is Chainage. First November 21, we have done subsequent erection on 25th November. So these are the delegates, those who are there, our MD in HRCL, our champ, our uh, one of our board of directors and heads for that available business, Japanese consultant, our project team. So those who are present there, and uh, in a, this type of occasions when happened. So this is a big gathering and uh, so many people are there. You can see lots of award for these projects. That company has uh, owned this award. We have International Safety Award, Outstanding Achievement in Environment Management, Environment Excellence, Initiative Award, Best Sustainability Award, Safety Awards, Lots of awards and applause we have achieved till now. Now, if you can see, there are some resembles and the comparisons between some big projects, Eiffel Tower, Statue of Unity, and Woods Khalifa. If you can see the concrete quantity, 68 lakh cubic meter, reinforcement 8 lakh ton. So you feel competitive of this. So Eiffel Tower 76 times. Only for C4 package. If we compare with Statue of Unity, 32 times. If we compare with Burj Khalifa, is it 20 times? So this is the volume we are doing. And if you see whatever the uh, project we have done so far, mainly the metros, Kochi 13 kilometer, Hyderabad 67, Riyadh 26 kilometer, RRTS 16 kilometer, but MSR C4 only one package, 237 kilometer. So now we can show you how the construction materials we are using, what is the tonnage? 32 lakhs metric tons cement, 8 lakh metric tons steel, that much of irrigated coin. This is the logistic, it's a huge logistic. 30 numbers FLSM, full span, long garter, that yard, C number SBS because T yard. 750 years land for at least 300 spans per month casting. That's a huge, huge, huge establishment. 30 numbers batching plant. So capacity 2,500 roughly cubic meter per hour. Dedicated queries. Six number RMS plant, 30,000 metric ton per month production for the reinforcement. And this is the Asia largest geotechnical laboratory. 300 borehole per month testing capacity. Those who are in the soil, you may have heard of it. The maximum time required for the consolation test, one sample will took eight days. And if it is a 40 meter board, so at least more than 10 or 15 samples you have to collect. So, you know, the drying period is there for any sample. We have to fast, make it more fastest way we have to take the test. So lots of equipment is required. So India, those who are the laboratory, they are not well equipment. Digitization was not there. They have done a lot of support we have taken, but still it was not sufficient. Then LNT has taken a decision to set up the own laboratory. So geotechnical laboratory you have set up in Surat. You can see the Asia largest geotechnical laboratory. Then only the test has been done in time and we can proceed with the piling and other job. So total project has been distributed and segregated in different sections, section one, two, three, four, five. So that way, and this is the five, this particular yard that is on chain 359, 93 acres. I think somebody is telling it's Asia largest precast yard. Production capacity, three kilometers of span per month, the huge casting yard. If you can see the other resource, what you have involved in this project, staff, roughly 1800, work, workers, definitely more than 18,000, 
So lots of foundations we have done to shorter this required. That is 150 numbers, spire, pile cap, 155 numbers, launching girder, six number, full span, AK one yard, 11 number SBS. So lots of saddle carrier, which is ca carrying this equipment, I mean, I mean uh, girder, everything, 10 beach gantry, six transporter, required for 1100 metric ton. There are rigs and cranes, 50 GTI rigs, 70 piling rigs. These are the, I mean, mobilizations in one area. Lots of mold, pickup steel, steel mold, 44 sets, full span, 21 sets, SBS, <coughs> other girders and everything. Because it is combination of so many elements. So accordingly, we have to plan mold to meet the target. If you can see some photographs, piling, pile cap, pier, pier cap, PR and PR cap, we are using mainly that finishing, I mean, uh, water rig, that curing compound, that's, that's, that's the patches you have seen, the uh, white patches. This is the casting yard, the shifting, whatever the video I have shown, I'm just show you in this still photograph. This is the stacking, how to do is stacking. This is the erection. This is the casting of our US LG garter. This is the assemble of LGLD and this erection. So this is the way we have done, mainly 40 meter span, we have done a full, and wherever the span is less or more little bit, there we are using this uh, system, which is called USLG card arrangement. This is the garter casting photos, garter shifting, garter stacking. You can see garter erection garter placing, how it is placed at the top, and garter transportation with the transporter, this garter can run above the erected garter. So there are four stations mainly. This so started from Bombay side is Bhapi, Dilimora, Surat, and Varut. So how it is, Bhapi is a side platform. I mean, station side, there are four tracks, side platform. Bilimuria side platform, Surat Island platform is in the center. Baruch is island and side platform. According to the train movement, train stoppage, there are some train with two train. All this combination planned accordingly, platform has been set. If we go for the view area, built up area, Surat is 10,000 plus. Depot mainly. Vapi is uh, 1,800. All other uh, depot are similar. There is a Car confirmation base, confirmation car base, that is at Bilimore area at that Vadat level. So at least like a siding of train or like that arrangement. Now, if you see the station, all station is capturing some cladding or outside finish, and which is a replica as the importance of that particular place. I'll explain. See, this is a Sura station. You can see. The external cladding, how it is like diamond, because you know Surat is famous for diamond. You can see the ceiling, it gives the diamond feeling. So this is the Surat speciality that is been captured in the architectural finishes. So this is the escalator and that concourse level, escalator platform level. These are the waiting area, business lounge, some views of the finishes I'll show you. Ticketing counter of customer care, automatic fare collection system, the nursery, first aid, deep facility, toilets and others. These are all things, how it is in the airport, and better way it is planned in the station area. Now I'll go back to the main depot, Sura depot. If you can see, Sura depot is across the Viaduct line, all other depot along the viaduct line. Because this area, Surat Station, for there is a ramp will is in under progress. Through this ramp, train can come down and it will go to the main depot. You can see the main depot where some maintenance, some checking can be done. And this is another depot, is maintenance depot. It is mainly for catering, other maintenance part of the track and other thing. So this is the Surat main depot. If you can see the today's progress, 
how it is a depot cladding work it has been done inside the depot a flooring and track why train will come and their equipment will be there there is a cladding installation crest on laying track in progress there is also another depot structure this is the present photographs of the project if we will see how an 11 ton saddle carrier fabricated at lnd kanchipuram what i have uh, explained earlier so this is the bigger view of lnd gti laboratory which is 50000 square feet this is the seismic stopper being manufactured at lnt azira workshop because you know seismic stopper is required and that is a mandatory for bullet train high speed train that is structural requirement designed by japan and this is the 1011 ton metric ton gada transporter that is also fabricated in lnt kanchipuram 